Sweet crazy loot, that's the smoke with the sweet fish All of the niggas know how to go We got 600 in the crazy pain The niggas out of Queens got shit on lock We spat with the clock, but we love it in smoke But if you're looking for the clock, this fat shit probably never will be going on Just tell me where you're from Huh? Shit, bullshit, I can't hear you If it wasn't for the Bronx, this fat shit probably never would be going on Tell me where you're from Y'all with me? Can y'all hear me for two seconds? Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Give, give me one second. Somebody tell BP to stop jerking off. Man up and get that fucking oil out the gulf. Hold up. Hold up. The Village Underground, and guess who I am sitting with? Peter Guns. Uptown, baby. Uptown, baby. We gets down, baby. So what's going on? <laughs> Yo, I'm mad, sleepy, and tired. My voice is hoarse, but I have fun. Steph, you know you family. A is family, so thank you, man. Thank you for coming through. Of course, no problem. Good press I'm getting. <laughs> So tell us how it feels to actually be on stage with your son Corey. Um, shit, man, it's, uh, it's it's hard to describe. It's hard to describe. It's almost like being a doctor and then your son becoming a doctor. You know what I mean? Same type of feeling. Okay. And um, what projects are you working on as far as yourself and with him? Well, I'm in a band with Raj. Mm -hmm. um, I just changed the name of the band to James Sun. <laughs> James Sun, J A M E Z S U N. It's a dedication to my father. I'm James Sun. He's James. So the name of our band is James Sun. Project is phenomenal. Um, that's my next project. And then I'm going to get in the studio and do another album with Tariq. But right now, the focus, primary focus is getting Corey off the ground okay. and everything will follow suit. And I know he's working with MTV on his show right now. So tell us a little bit how he's reacting to having the camera on him all the time, especially if he's not used to it. Because I know you you were the one in the limelight, and you still are. But what is it like for him from your point of view? Well, Corey is really shy. What? So it's rough trying to get something out of Corey on um, camera. See, I can't get nothing out of Corey with just me and him talking. So then you mic him up and put a camera in his face. You definitely ain't gonna get shit out of him. So it's rough, it's hard, but I think the show is, I think the show is gonna be uh, pretty good. So him going from Rockefeller to Young Money, how does that make you feel? Um, I just think it's perfect fit. Mm -hmm. Wayne is a spitter. Mm -hmm. They all young, crazy. <laughs> And they're all very talented. I think it's a perfect fit for Corey. I think this is it. It's, it's such a, it's such a perfect move, man. Big shout to uh, uh, Free Weezy, fuck NYPD. <laughs> Yeah. You know what I mean? But no, it's my brother Dula right there. It's keeping it real, y'all. Real. No, no, um, anybody that know hip hop know that's a that's a great move for Corey. And um, Wayne will be home in November, and we'll take it from there. It's all good.